After another tough week, the president is headed for his happy place, Palm Beach and the Winter White House Mar-a-Lago. It's his fifth visit there in the two months since he became president. But what about the official presidential retreat, Camp David in rural Maryland? Trump seems to have no interest in it whatsoever. Camp David is just a 20-minute helicopter ride from the White House, and it has been a favorite getaway for presidents for 80 years. Caroline Kennedy learned to ride a pony at Camp David, and President Obama enjoyed pool time with little Sasha. The Obamas went to Camp David 39 times. George W. Bush, 150 times. President Trump, not once. Some say Camp David may be just way too boring for President Trump. After all, his New York home, Trump Tower, is in the heart of New York City, the city that never sleeps. Even today, the St. Patrick's Day Parade is going right by his front door. Camp David is very rustic, Trump told the Times of London. It's nice. You'd like it. You know how long you'd like it? For about 30 minutes. We took a drive to Camp David, or at least as far as we could go. It's a secured area. It sure is beautiful, but very remote and so cold. There's a foot of snow on the ground. Pair that to sunny Palm Beach, where it's a balmy 80 degrees. For a president with penthouse tastes, you go to Mar-a-Lago. Veteran CBS White House correspondent Mark Knoller has covered stories at Camp David going back to the Ford administration. They're very luxurious. They're certainly as nice as a, a you know, a top grade hotel, but it's not penthouse. And if uh, President Trump is looking for penthouse accommodations, he's certainly not going to find it at Camp David. Rustic tranquility versus over-the-top luxury. For this president, there really is no choice.